today was just one of those days where I couldn't pass up a ride on the motorcycle. I thought I'd talk a little bit about uh, roundabouts, or as somebody people call them traffic circles. First ones I've ever run into were in New Jersey. Uh, the ones there are fairly large, at least the one I know of, where two major highways came together. Uh, and then I saw a real big one in London when I was there in the service. Almost got killed uh, on that one, but that's a story for another day. Just recently, in the last few years, our little part of Kansas here has fallen in love with the roundabouts. And uh, they've just about replaced the four-way stops for us. This section of road that I'm on here um, has a, a series of them that I've, I've not seen anywhere else. There's uh, probably center, seven or ten of them here in a, in a two or three mile stretch. It's a housing division that uh, hasn't been completed yet. But I go there every once in a while just to practice my turns. And uh, kind of enjoyable. This one, I don't know if you can see it on the video or not. Uh, one of the ones further along here had some gravel on it, and that kind of worried me a little bit. You probably notice I slowed down for it. But, uh, how about you all? Do you have roundabouts in your part of the country? You may be able to tell it was a little bit windy today, but uh, I just couldn't pass up the nice sunny day. Temperatures in the 60s. Yeah, I turned around and heading back the other way here. So I think I'll uh, sign it off here for now. Thanks everybody if you're still watching and listening. And uh, let me know if you have any good suggestions for uh, an inexpensive camera with an external mic. So I can actually talk as I ride along.